सो हाय एवरीवन आज हम ऐसा श्रुति है सो so, हम उनसे बात करने वाले हैं कि उनकी कॉलेज जर्नी किस तरीके से रही थी उनका कैसे प्लेसमेंट हुआ इंटर्नशिप लगी सभी चीजों के बारे में हम देखने वाले हैं तो हाय श्रुति कैसे हो आप हाय तरुण आई एम डूइंग ग्रेट हाउ आर यू डूइंग आई एम आल्सो गुड सो सबसे पहले आप हमारी ऑडियंस को बताओ यार आपका इंट्रो बता दो कि आप कौन से कॉलेज से हो आ, क्या ब्रांच थी आपकी उस तरीके से आप स्टार्ट कर दो थोड़ा Sure. So my name is Shruti Grover, and I am a final year student pursuing BTech from Vanasthali University in IT domain. I have previously worked in Visa as a software engineer intern. Moreover, I have been the part of various tech events like JP Morgan Code for Good, Flipkart GWC, and Google Women's Engineer. I have also cracked Flipkart for the role of software development engineer. Okay. Thank you. या तो सबसे पहले स्टार्ट करते हैं यार कॉलेज जर्नी से कि आपने फर्स्ट ईयर में क्या सोच के कंप्यूटर साइंस लिया था या जो भी ब्रांच ली थी आपने क्या आपको बोला गया था पेरेंट्स ने दिलवाई थी या आपने ही खुद से चूज करी कि इंजीनियरिंग में जाना है क्या हुआ था उस टाइम yeah it was my own decision to choose engineering as my career but for the branch i was preferring more to the cs but for the rank by the rank purpose i got it but now i don't regret because there are more opportunities in it than cs and in the very first, first two years were of covid and we were having online classes so i started learning through myself only but initially i was not getting anything the in the first semester i was having c language only 50% of the thing i was getting because i was from non cs background i was not having computer science in my 11th 12th i was from physical education but initially then i slowly slowly i started learning c++ and have explored many fields in web technologies and android development and much more ओके सो फर्स्ट ईयर में कॉलेज का एटमॉस्फेयर किस तरीके से मतलब आप तो ऑनलाइन कर रहे थे तो उतना कुछ पता नहीं चला होगा आपको कि कॉलेज में कैसा होता है सीनियर्स से आप उतना मिल नहीं पाते होगे कि किसका फोर्थ ईयर में मैक्सिमम पैकेज लगा इस तरीके से कुछ हुआ था आपको पता चला था कि क्या हुआ है या वी फर्स्ट हैड आवर इनोग्रेशन बाय द प्रेसिडेंट लाइक द बाय द वाइस चांसलर ऑफ आवर कॉलेज सो ही ओनली टोल्ड अस लाइक गोल्डमैन विजिटेड एंड it was the highest package at that time with from my college but then we started contacting our seniors and they told us how are the placements going in which year we get the companies so uh, first year was like little bit we were having only the knowledge like only amex goldman these companies visited so then i started preparing and i have applied many more to many opportunities on the off campus also i was the part of google step in turn like i gave the interview but i was rejected but this was all about like learning process so hum first year ki baat karenge ki jaise aapne bataya ki first year mein maine bahut sari cheeze start kar di thi to first year ke saath mein hi aapne sab kuch start kar diya tha ki slowly slowly pehle language kari fir web development mein gaye aap kaise hua tha journey aur aapko kabhi aisa या डीमोटिवेशन नहीं लगा कि यार लैंग्वेज में सीख रही हूँ ट्वेल्थ के बाद फर्स्ट टाइम आके तो मुझे बहुत ही अजीब लग रहा है कि यार कैसे ये चलता है मुझे बहुत ही डिफिकल्ट फील हो रहा है इस तरीके से कुछ हुआ था और उसने आप, आप yes. तो कैसे टैकल किया या आई वॉज नॉट गेटिंग एनी थिंग लाइक हाउ द प्रोग्राम आर एक्सिक्यूटिंग बट फर्स्टली I started learning C. Then I switched to C plus plus because the syntax and the concept was little bit similar only. And after learning C plus plus, I moved to DSA part. So initially in the DSA, I just learned about arrays, strings, how these works. And by the end of the first year, I started learning DSA completely. Like I moved to linked list, tags, queues. With the like mid of the second year, I completed my first like revision of DSA. by the half of my second year i completed that and with side by side i started exploring web technologies until second year i was only familiar with html css and javascript that's it okay so second year mein bhi aapke college mein internships opportunity milti thi ya third year mein aapke yahan aaya karti hai kis tarike se hua tha in, in third year only the companies come for internship not in second year but i have applied to many places in the second year because i was prepared but it was all off campus so uh, but though i faced rejections but it was all the part of my learning process like i applied to google step so it, this was my first interview like i 
experience with the Google employees. So I cleared first and second round but I was rejected in the third round but after that I worked more and more harder I started giving contests on lead code code chef which helped me to clear online assessments and also interviews during my third year internship okay so third year ke baare mein discuss karte hai thoda sa ki third year mein internship bhi aane lagti hai to aapke yahan kya college mein aayi thi internship ya aap bahar se apply kar rahe the kis tarike se wo raha tha aur kaun si company first aayi thi aapko rejections kitne mile aur uske baad कौन सी कंपनी में आपका हुआ वो सब के बारे में थोड़ा बताओ सो विद इन द लास्ट ईयर ऑफ माई सेकेंड ईयर जे पी मॉगन कोट फॉर गुड हैपन्स सो दिस स्टार्टेड लाइक दे रजिस्ट्रेशन स्टार्टेड एंड इट वॉज टू राउंड प्रोसेस फर्स्ट वॉज ऑनलाइन असेसमेंट एंड फॉलोड बाय द वन वीडियो रिकॉर्डिंग राउंड सो आई अप्लाई गेव टू बोर्ड द राउंड एंड आफ्टर दैट आई वॉज सेलेक्टेड फॉर द जे पी मॉगन कोट फॉर गुड हैकाथॉन सो एट दैट टाइम आई पार्टिसिपेटेड इन दैट हैकाथॉन एंड इट वॉज लाइक we i contributed to the front end project i worked on html css and js only and we built a successful project on kotak education and after that uh, they have to release the results like to, to which they are giving the internships or not so i was expecting that that i'll get the internship from there but unfortunately that didn't get from there so this was my first rejection in the third year for the internship and after that uh, in my college american express visited and also uh, i have not cleared that oa and next after to that visa visited and visa was like my uh, third company that visited my college and i was able to crack it okay so visa ke bare mein thoda sa jante hai ki visa ke andar kitne rounds hue the kaisi process thi college ke andar jab visa aayi thi so visa was totally on campus opportunity the eligibility criteria was like cgpa should be greater than or equal to 7 and there should not be any active backlog only this much so there were two, total two rounds one round was uh, online assessment which consist of two questions that was of level lead code medium and the next round was the technical plus hr interview so the interviewer was asking mix questions from technical also and from hr also it totally depends on them but this time the process has been changed a little bit in oa you can see four questions but at my time there were only two okay so aap topics ke bare mein thoda sa bataoge ki aapka jo interview hua tha usme ek data structure se related pucha tha ya project se bhi related pucha tha aur data structure se related pucha tha to kon kon se topics unne mainly puche the aapse so uh, in the interview the interview started with the dsa only she asked one or two like warm up questions so that i can com- get comfortable with her so after moving to that she just uh, told me that you have solved all the questions with all the test cases passed so she was expecting my technical like my problem solving skills must be very good so she asked me which is my favorite algorithm so i answered like it's greedy so she asked like what is greedy and she threw one or two questions on that and after uh, solving that questions in 5 to 10 minutes she moved to sql queries so she asked me to write some sql queries using joins in and between operator and after that she asked me like theoretical questions from oops dbms and operating system and also she asked me like uh, some hr questions like where do you want to see yourself in the next 5 years what are your strengths and weaknesses and some situational based questions like how will you react when your manager will tell your negative feedbacks and your mistakes that's how it went also she asked me like uh, some questions related to my project the technologies that i used so she asked some theoretical questions only okay so third year mein aate aate aapne kuch projects bhi banaye honge थोड़ा उसके बारे में बताओ कि आपने कैसे प्रोजेक्ट बनाए कौन सी टेक्नोलॉजी पे बेस्ड थे वो और किस तरीके से आपने प्रोजेक्ट बनाने सीखा वो थोड़ा बताओ ये सो आई स्टार्टेड लर्निंग बैक एंड टेक्नोलॉजीज नोट चेस uh and mon बेसिकली mon यूज मोंगो डीबी डेटाबेस सो आई स्टार्टेड लर्निंग थ्रू YouTube ओनली एंड इन द थर्ड लास्ट ईयर लास्ट सेमेस्टर वी वर हैविंग द project as a course in our semester so b- we built the project through that ma- the major project uh, which was related to like uh, giving the houses on rents and but beside that my personal project was like a zoom application and something that i learned through youtube only and i have implemented it so overall web development was like seeing the youtube and implementing it on my own my main focus was on data structures and algorithm at that time because placement was also there 
सो so, वीजा की इंटर्नशिप के बारे में बताओ यार ये वीजा की इंटर्नशिप किस तरीके से थी कि वीजा कंपनी आपको कैसे लगी आपकी इंटर्नशिप कंप्लीट हो चुकी है तो आपको कैसा फील आ रहा था वहां पे और क्या क्या सीखा आपने वहां पे so the entire internship was very good at visa visa provides very good uh, like stay at hotel it was two months stay at hotel in the three star hotel and beside that they give so many perks and also i have learned many things at visa i have worked on react js technology so my project was uh, related to like te- uh, migrating the tech stack so, and so i have to read the whole code which was written earlier and then we have migrated the code in the new technologies so in the entire two month duration i have learned the technology also and i have implemented it also side by side but beside learning these technologies the internship was overall fun it was full of learning and experience i had again lots of experience and uh, lots of connection also ओके सो अब आप स्टूडेंट्स को कुछ शेयर करना चाहते हो कि किस तरीके से उनको तैयारी करना चाहिए कौन से ईयर में उन्हें क्या कंप्लीट कर लेना चाहिए जिससे उन्हें इंटर्नशिप मिल जाए और फोर्थ ईयर में उन्हें प्लेसमेंट मिल जाए अच्छा सा और बहुत सारे स्टूडेंट ऐसे भी होते हैं जो अच्छे कॉलेज से नहीं होते तो उनके यहाँ इंटर्नशिप्स नहीं आ रही होती है तो उनको किस तरीके से प्रिपेयर कर लेना चाहिए कि उन्हें बाहर से भी मिल सके इंटर्नशिप सो आई थिंक डी एस इज द मेन सोर्स दैट वन शुड लर्न वन शुड ऑलवेज फोकस ऑन द प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग स्किल्स so they can start learning from lead code solving lead code and gfg platform which is which basically focus on the core dsa and beside that they should also focus on the core subjects that we have dbms oops operating system and networking and if they have interest in web development they should definitely build some projects on webd or if they have interest in android one so they should start exploring the fields within the second year only within the first and second year so that at the time of third year they should not get confused to which they should follow and not they should much be familiar with the tech stacks that they are familiar that they should learn so uh, in the while completing the second year they should know like what is dsa and they should have medium le- they can solve medium level of problems because within the starting of the third year we get the companies in our college and also the off campus uh, they start hiring from july august so may june uh, till may june they should complete the dsa and they should always try to give the mock interviews at different sites that are available and i uh, what's my secret key is like all before giving the interview i always try to read the articles of that company so basically it's like 20 to 30% of the content is same like they ask like these types of things only the topics are same but the questions always depends on the interviewer what do want to ask so this was my uh, like journey like how i learned okay thank you shruti bahut acha laga aapse baat karke aapki journey ke bare mein jankar thank you so much thank you tarun